How's it going everybody? Ten runs returned with some goodies. So we've just got to come up with these new ideas and new ways for us to really make it work. So I'm working with a few people where we're exploring things like... Um, uh, the guy just forgot that he runs live Zoom meeting with his previously recorded video. Uh, video, uh, iPhone video, um, you know, working with people who might have an SLR in their home. It's a matter of wonder how the sun looks so tiny in comparison with other galaxy elements. Oh, this man knows how to create a whirlpool underwater. Step number one, breathe out some of the air in your lungs so you don't float up. Step number two, point your index finger up and spin it around fast close to the surface till a small whirlpool appears. Step number three, stop spinning your fingers and start moving your hand from side to side like you can see me do in the video. The angle of the hand is very important. The way I'm holding my hand is pulling the water down when I move it to the side and growing the whirlpool. The dad decided to talk to the baby like a big man to see his reactions. Like go somewhere else with that, but don't break it here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what I said, and he was like, ah, you know what I'm saying? And I was like, what in the world? But don't do that here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The reaction between iodine pentoxide and iron powder creates a massive volcanic eruption. Point of view of Newark autumn treetops in Roscoe look like underwater coral. Oh my god, I can't believe I landed that. Here's a quick announcement that our channel reached 600 subs today. Thank you for all of you guys' support. Turn on the notifications if you want. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.